Hi students, in ICC chemistry for class 8, today we are going to learn all the different types of oxides with example. Friends, this is Orijit sir in my channel Orijit Khosh Chemistry Online. So before we start today's session, I like to tell you, please subscribe my channel to get more information from my videos. Okay students? Hello students, welcome back. I have came here today for in the ICC chemistry part for class 8 all different types of oxides so students uh, in this chapter we are going to learn today that what type of oxides are there how many types of oxides are there and their different characteristics okay so now uh, i'm writing it here the so oxides means that there should be an oxygen should be present in that compound okay students so i'm writing it down the different types of oxides okay number one is our acidic oxides okay and number two basic oxide number three neutral oxide and number four amphoteric oxide so basically these are the four types of oxides that are present okay so it is in your syllabus now acidic oxide that means these are the oxides which produces acids okay so remember and the basic oxides these are the oxides that mainly produces bases and neutral oxides which doesn't react with any uh, acid or bases and the amphoteric oxides are basically those oxides which basically reacts with acid as well as with the bases okay students now i am giving you some of the examples to fit it now say acidic oxide examples sulfur dioxide see students the non metallic oxides listen carefully the non metallic oxides are basically acidic oxides Okay, see so sulfur dioxide, carbon dioxide, nitrogen dioxide, phosphorus pentoxides. These are the all types of oxides, uh, acidic oxides. Okay, and what about the basic oxide? Basic oxides are the metals. The metals, metallic oxides, which produces bases or alkalis when reacts with water these are the basic oxides okay i'm writing it down see sodium oxide calcium oxide potassium oxide so these are the basic oxides okay and what about the neutral oxide students neutral oxides yeah, actually these are also some of them are uh, non metallic oxides see our water that is hydrogen monoxide or water is neutral oxide nitric oxide carbon monoxide and nitrous oxide so these are all neutral oxides okay students now what about the amphoteric oxides amphoteric oxide basically i have already told you that these are the oxides which doesn't react that they, they react with acids as well as with the bases these are the all amphoteric oxides okay now see aluminium oxide zinc oxide lead oxide so these are the amphoteric oxides okay students now why these acidic oxides are acidic in nature and why the basic oxides are basic in nature so acidic oxides basically produces acids say for example if these are the oxides sulfur dioxide reacts with water to form sulfurous acid you can see carbon dioxide when reacts with water it produces carbonic acid h2co3 nitrogen dioxide reacts with water to produce nitric acid and nitrous acid as a mixture nitrous acid and nitric acid phosphorus pentoxide when reacts with water it produces phosphoric acid 
okay so that's why these oxides are acidic oxide okay students now see the basic oxide basically produces bases i'm taking uh, three examples so sodium oxide these are the sodium oxide when reacts with water it produces in a wage that is sodium hydroxide calcium oxide calcium oxide reacts to produce calcium hydroxide and potassium oxide produces potassium hydroxide so students so these are the basically uh, the points so where the oxides are being produced okay so uh, see it carefully uh, this is how we are uh, producing it that the chapter is acidic oxide basic oxide neutral oxide and amphoteric oxide so students uh, hope you like this video it's a very small video for you i have already made it for class 8 okay so uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel and please share it with other friends and don't forget to give comments okay thank you students goodbye